Hi everyone and welcome back. So today we are going to talk about membership management in Odoo. In Odoo membership management is done by members module. It supports various types of members like free members, paid, associated and special members. And it is integrated with other modules like sales, accounting and all. And membership fun management is a function that can be customized according to the need of end client. So let us see how it is managed. First of all, we can configure a membership product. Here you can create a membership product and give a name of the membership product. And you can give an internal reference for this membership product. It can be unique code that is given to it. Then product category. You can add a product category under which it belongs. Then company name. And whether this product is active. If unchecked, it will allow you to hide the product without removing it. Then you can add a description here and a sales description for this product and membership duration the duration of the membership suppose it is from this day to okay, one month then membership fee you can give a membership fee for you and this price at which the product is sold to customers then income account you can give specify an income account here Then you can also add some taxes for this membership. After that, save this membership product. So a membership product is created. Okay, let us create a member. This member can be can be an individual or a company. Let it be an individual. Okay. Then you can add a company here. So automatically the address of the company came then it is type you can add it as contract contact or invoice address okay then job position of this person can be added here then his phone number mobile email other details like website link title it can be like mr Ms. and all then language tax can be given tax can be like you can give like employees or okay like that you can give tax then you can add contacts and address just like what you have seen in the creation of a contact uh, for more information just refer the contacts video then under sales and purchase you can also see some configuration of sales purchase. You can add the salesperson and delivery method, then payment terms, then for purchase also some payment terms and supplier currency. Then under point of sale, you can give the barcode and loyalty points, then physical position just to map tax and account, then miscellaneous operation. Under that, you can add the reference and company like website details, website to which you need to restrict this okay. and under accounting also you can see accounting grid settings that can be managed on the parent company then internal notes can be given just to block or just to give warning for in the case of selling purchasing or picking some product then membership this is the main thing you need to know about and under this member creation for this module here you can specify whether this member is free or not. So if you tick freeze, you can see current membership status is free. So he does not need to make any invoice or make payment for getting membership products. So if you untick this free member, then current membership status, you can see a buy mem membership came and you can see an associate member. You can add an associate member here. So if if he's not a free member 
and he needs some membership product he need to click this buy membership okay membership you can see that name then that name of that product then member price okay it is automatically came then invoice membership that is in so now the invoice is creating draft okay the five is actually the gst tax is applied in now the invoice is created so invoice need to be created for his membership that is this is not free he is not a free member and you can select that so the invoice is created for this person you can see the it is posted so under membership you can see details here membership fee and invoice details and paid member can be seen and you can also see an associate member so if you give an associate member then by assigning associate member then current member get membership during the membership period of the associate member okay now you can save this so in this way you can create members and add membership and you can see for this member invoice is 100 and you can see the meetings opportunities sales and all for this member and under reporting also you can make a members analysis you can members make members analysis based on peer review also so that's all about this module and thanks for watching If you are interested in knowing more about this or looking for any odu implementation or customization in your business drop your request to info@cybrosis.com